How's it going everyone? Welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to watch One Piece episode 104. Last episode, the Straw Hat Pirates arrived at Yuba. Unfortunately, the Rebellion army was not actually there. They moved out a long time ago to Katarea, which the crew just went past. Let's see how they're going to get back there. If you'd like to help support our channel, our Patreon link is down in the description below. You'll get early access to all the videos that we post onto this channel as well as our main channel. And you'll get our full and carry reactions to the One Piece series. So if you're interested in those, make sure to check it out. Now on to the anime. Ikimashou! <laughs> they always attack each other's nose. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> she got used to it. Wow. So loyal. <laughs> He's sticking it back in the Luffy. You idiot. <laughs> He's wasting his energy right now. Why is that thing so creepy? Oh, is that like a do they Rock work works? for them? Yeah, that's what I mean, right? <laughs> it's a lizard. This stood out so much. <laughs> How did he bring him back up? Why does she keep slamming the table? Stop! What if she pisses off the higher ranks? Like, is she scared? Sucks in me, Utopia. Crocodile. They just find out who oh he is. Oh my god. <laughs> they just have to get out of here. pirates, but he's a pirate. <laughs> Dude, none of them are gonna say anything. He didn't explain it to us. Steel? Is it a resource? <laughs> Why does she keep saying that? さまらがまっとうした時この荒場した王国は自ら大破し行き場を失った反乱軍と国民たちはあえなく我がバロックワークス社の手中に陥る結構は明日の十二時やばいやん分を祈るあいかにおいしそうおまいごwhat the why f would he even just appear he's like hold up objection i cannot say if he is ballsy or, or stupid, stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, he already knew. Oh, why is that? <gasps> oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> None of them. Yo, he's gonna die right now. He feared to the crocodile pet. This is it. <laughs> That's just a snack, yo. Oh no. Why did you come? I mean, I hate you still, but <laughs> you're stupid for coming. <laughs> a banana <laughs> <What>? <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh my god, he's dead. He was he an example. doesn't give any shit. He was an example. <laughs> Why is he making those faces for them? <laughs> 700,000? There are people that infiltrated actually. That was Mr. Three. なんとか、そいつを蒸留して水を絞り出した。おお、なんか難しいけどありがとう。全然みんな。よいさんさ。いつもオフダンウフ。やめた。やめたって。こんなとこでお前の気まぐれに付き合ってる暇ねえんだぞ。俺はクロコダイルをぶっ飛ばしてんだよ。反乱してる奴らを止めたらよ。クロコダイルは止まんのか。大体カトレアについても何もすることはね
Whoa! Whoa. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> he really went at that. <laughs> she just go ahead and not stop. Oh my god, they're not even trying to stop. Dude, I'm so scared. I'm super hyped, but I'm so scared for them. What the heck? I mean, would the crocodiles attack even work on Luffy? He's rubber. He's still water, right? I think it'll still work. But if you dehydrate rubber, does that even do anything? I don't, I don't know. Actually, that's it could, it, it could, because like you know when uh, rubber, like a rubber band, is super old, it like breaks easily. It snaps. It could be like that, maybe. I don't know. I guess so. Oh my goodness! <laughs> they didn't tell us what their true plan was or their true goal. He was like going to reveal it, so he revealed it to everybody, yeah, but they didn't but reveal us. it to us. Seems like they're after some kind of Something. resource mm -hmm. within the kingdom. So maybe it's like a resource that he's aware of, but the kingdom itself is not aware of. That's why he's trying to get it for himself. Is that what he's saying? I think he said something like that, right? Something that really exists in this country. Yeah, I don't so know. it's not. I don't think it's the position. It's of not the position. The world government, right? He says military might, and then afterwards he's like referring to some kind of resource. What if that resource can give them power? Oh, give them power? What to if To make weapons or something, I don't know. Oh, okay. Right? Something, something like, like the that. dance powder or something like that? Yeah, maybe something exclusive to Alabasta hmm. that they could use to make weapons. That's, that's the only thing I can put military might and then an object. Something like that really exists in this country. So it's something that's never seen before? So I guess it would be something that would be kind of absurd, like be dance powder. Like, something it would, crazy? Yeah, something crazy that would somehow give them extra powers or help them make weapons or something like, like that. Like, an underground cave in the middle of the desert under the palace that has devil fruit trees growing. Devil fruit so trees growing? I don't growing. know. <laughs> yeah. I can't think of anything. That's so funny. I don't know. Maybe something like that. Right, so he needs to take over this kingdom to yeah. get that resource. He, he, or whatever. Whatever that right. thing is, because Mr. Two is questioning it. It's like, that really exists in this country? And that mm. was it for Mr. Three? I can't believe he showed himself. Like, we totally knew that was coming for him. He, Croc he, why would Crocodile forgive? Does he look like a forgiving guy? Does he act like a forgiving guy? He, <laughs> I think he was pushing it. Maybe Crocodile would have let him live, and Mister Two, uh, Mister Three wasn't like. But but I was supposed to take them out, you know, instead of like the whole organization going to get them. Maybe he was pushing. The thing is, he didn't buttons. even accomplish a single thing, and then he comes back saying that he'll accomplish it. But it's like, okay, well, you didn't even accomplish it the first time. Yeah. Why would I trust you the second time? Kind of thing, right? That's true. Yeah, because he had no idea because yeah. Sanji was on the other side. Yeah, screw that guy. Yeah, it was just. The, his death, it was like, I wasn't even satisfied with his death because it was so shocking that mm -hmm. how evil Crocodile is because it's like, you know how when Mr. 3 was revealed, right? We were yeah. like, oh, this guy's so scummy, right? Mm -hmm. And then now with Crocodile, seeing how evil he is, it's like he almost override yeah. <laughs> in Mr. 3's <laughs> evilness yeah, or scumminess true. because we're so fixated on, on how bad and evil Crocodile mm -hmm. is. Yeah, he just fed him to his pet. And now they're going to go to Crocodile. Dude, I'm so scared. How are they going to go to Crocodile? I honestly can't see it. Based on what Crocodile is capable of. And like, you know, like, mm -hmm. just compare prior villains that they've fought. Mm -hmm. You know, they've 
the crew has struggled immensely. Like, for example, Arlong, mm-hmm. they almost fucking died during that time. Against the fishmen. Right? Against the fishmen. And then when I compare Arlong to Crocodile, Crocodile is like miles, ways ahead. Mm-hmm. In terms of strength compared to our loss. So that's why I'm so scared for them yeah, right now. Because we're talking about the seven warlords, right? And then we saw um, Hawkeye's Mihawk as one of the seven warlords and he destroyed everything so easily. Almost killed Zoro. Exactly. Um, like it was nothing. With that little baby dagger. Dagger, <laughs> dagger right? So it's like, how strong of a person are they fighting? And we're now almost like 100% sure that he's the one drying up the deserts and water and everything. Because yeah. he can do that to human, I'm assuming he can do that to an environment. Mm-hmm. So how would they fight him then? Yeah. Technically there's no counter, right? They don't counter him in yeah. any way. They have to probably fight the agents first. And then they'll fight him. Maybe Smoker will come into play somehow. Because remember... They brought him in, and then all of a sudden he was. Oh yeah, he is tailing them again. Yeah, he is tailing them. Maybe right he now. can come help somehow. But even then, I don't see them winning against mm-hmm. Crocodile. Um, maybe because Smoker is there, they can't fight Crocodile directly. Because then, Cro- and then somebody from the um, Navy will know about Crocodile's true identity, which would put him at risk because he's one of the seven warlords that's supposed to be protected. You, you see what I mean? Yeah, isn't he? But then isn't he? Because if someone from the navy knows that I don't he's, I think the up navy to... can do anything. But then, Crocodile, right? no. But then they they're under the world government. And the world government is the one that pardons the seven warlords in yeah. the first place, right? So if the world government finds out that Crocodile is doing this, wouldn't there some kind of consequence? Well, if they didn't care, then see, why would know. he hide his identity in the first place? There's a con there's a consequence there, i'm assuming there's some kind of consequence if people find out his true identity and that he's the one behind this whole rebellion right like i'm assuming that's why he's trying to hide his identity isn't he hiding it because he's in the public's eye he's a hero so if he, if he was actually pulling the strings he would lose the support is, is that why yeah that's why i'm saying like whether it's that or some other kind of consequence, there has to be some consequence See, that, for that's him actually the, yeah. having his identity revealed. That's the thing also with the world government. We don't really know if the world government is corrupted or not. Like, mm-hmm. they say that they pardon the warlords, but is it like, can they just do whatever the hell they want now? I don't think so. I, mean, I think that's why he's hiding his uh, true identity. Because, like, if he could just do whatever he wants, then why did he even have to go through all this? He needs this? to win the people's approval. Right? Oh, you're saying that I'm he, saying he's only he has to be like crowned king by the people yeah, and not the, forcefully. Yeah, the, right now, Crocodile is saving the day and, and he's kind of being like, I'm not here to save you, I'm just here to do whatever. Okay. And people love him uh-huh. while the um, crowned king right now isn't always makes it one step behind, right? Uh-huh. So they're lo- he, um, Crocodile is gaining the support, so... But- what does what the that? people's support have to do with anything? Like- Overthrowing, like the like the rebels and stuff. They'll join the rebel army, and then if Crocodile backs up the rebel army, they can overthrow the government because now the government is considered evil. Like the king, the yeah, king is considered evil. Yeah, but that doesn't evil. necessarily put him in the position to be king. Right? They put him in the position that- to be the like a part of the government to rule the place and he's know. after that resource he's not after alabasta itself like the people itself he's after the country the position or anything he's not after any of that he's saying he needs the country because he there is there's some kind of resource or whatever that he needs right that's how i interpreted it at least now, i'm just trying to think how they can stop him right because yeah i don't know how they're gonna stop him because they I can't even it, touch him. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I think maybe if there's someone that is ma- Marines or Navy that is aware of his I- true identity and goals, then it puts his um, plan at risk because now the world government perhaps may find out about all this, which I don't think they will agree with him doing. He's overthrowing a country from the... From the shadows like uh, this, i don't think they'll this is let a him do that rough topic i guess it's like he's a higher up he's in a way higher position than any marine and the marine is trying to technically file a complaint on a superior 
like position yeah. right isn't that like already that's true out of their power kind of thing that's true so i don't know if they're really gonna listen also with the uh, the position the world government is at yeah, because then again, I don't even know, like, if they find out he's doing something bad, they, like, can yeah, they even they, stop him? Like, is the world government strong? I'm assuming they have, must have some kind of, like... But that's the thing, though, fighting, like, if right? they're just as strong as the Seven Warlords, why do they even need the Seven Warlords in the first place? <laughs> you know what I'm saying, right? Because they only need the Seven Warlords because the Seven Warlords go pick off strong pirates that the Marines can't handle themselves. So it's like, okay, if the Seven War, if the world government has people that are just as strong as mm -hmm. the seven warlords why do they even need them in the first place they could just go handle everything themselves maybe they'll have to fight they're avoiding the fight right? between the world government and the seven warlords yeah just because they're strong could that be it i don't know why they would do that though let's say let's say if they they have people just as strong right mm -hmm. but for them to fight it's going to get really like no one will win like there's going to be huge losses or something. It's a, it's more of a disadvantage. Is it, is it like that? I think it's more of a disadvantage for them. Like I think it's more of a disadvantage for the world government currently because the seven warlords are pirates. They're pirates. They're and pardoned. They're kind of being pardoned to do whatever. We, we they don't want. really know what they gain. Do like do they have to provide something to the world government? They're providing something for sure. I don't know what they're providing though. Cause they're they're, ki they're killing the pirates. Is that what they are? Yeah, doing? the bounties are like the the lower oh, they're tier pirates. They're capturing pirates. Yeah, the lower tier pirates. They're helping them finish them off. Is Crocodile doing that? Yeah. He was protecting the city. Remember when the pirates came and they were like those pig pirates? They were like trying to attack the town. Oh, oh and yeah, then Crocodile yeah, yeah. came and mm -hmm. saved them. He's doing yeah, that kind I of stuff. I can't tell. Was he saving them because he that was his position as a warlord? He was saving them to win the people's approval. Both. Both? And then Hawkeye's was after um man, what's his name again? The shield guy. Was it Captain Morgan? No, that's the axe guy. Who, who are you talking about? Uh, Hawkeyes yeah. fall that um, pirate leader from uh -huh. Sanji's arc all the way from Grand Line out just because he's bored. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Remember that? Like, yeah. maybe that was like the hunting, I guess, for the warlords. Yeah. I forgot his name. It was like another pirate. Yeah. Yeah, I the shield guy, that, the yeah. gold shield guy, armor guy. Okay, I guess, sure, they kind of hunt pirates. I guess that's their job. Yeah, I think but they they're, have to do that. But they're pardoned to do whatever the hell they want. No, it's. Pardon, as in the Marines won't go after them. Oh, okay. So they coexist, kind of. They kind of coexist, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. But I, I, in my opinion, I feel like the Marines are kind of at a disadvantage because you have criminals under you, you know what I mean? Above them? Are they above them? They're like above them, right? Like equal ground, I guess. You have, you have criminals on equal yeah. ground as you, which yeah. is, I think, in my opinion, I think... They have more of a disadvantage on the world government side rather mm -hmm. than the pirates. The pirates seem like they have more of an advantage. Yeah. They're get I feel like they're receiving more on this relationship because they're uh -huh. getting pardoned when they just have to hunt a couple pirates. Like that's Actually, not I, feel, I feel like them. the world government should have some strong people. Whether, I think they whether do. it's a marine or not. Because I don't understand why they would listen, right? The seven warlords. Why would they listen to the government? Yeah. All right. If they're that's just a pushover, they're just going to like. I'll be the government now. Like I'll take them out. So there's someone in the right? world government that is just as strong. Like or they have or to stronger. Yeah, stronger. Has to be stronger. Stronger right? or something or equal level or like like there'll be a lot of bloodshed if they try to fight. Mm -hmm. I don't know if there'll be the strongest kind of thing, but mm -hmm. like maybe that's why. Mm -hmm. Like they haven't shown him really. The only people they've shown for the Marines is just Smoker's probably the strongest from the Marines. Right? Yeah, so far. Right, so far oh. from the Marines. Thanks for watching everyone. If you guys enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up. It really helps with the channel. And if you're new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Peace.